Tai Chi has been practiced for hundreds of years by humans. Now, thanks to a project at RIT, robots have not only joined in, but could soon be teaching the skill to others. Liam Healy talked with one of the researchers about what they've learned so far and what's next. Meet now. Hello, I'm now. Now is one of the first robots who is able to not only perform, but also teach Tai Chi. Tai Chi is a type of mind-body exercise. Uh, it itself is a physical exercise, but it also contains many cognitive uh, components. While there are still limitations to what now can do, you can see that the commercial robot is not specifically de designed for Tai Chi. It has a, a very flexible arms and legs, but it does not twist the span. So far, the robot has been well received. Pilot study in Milwaukee with uh, local people. Uh, I think the average age was in the 70s. They um, told us that they really loved the exercise. They could follow the robot well. In the future, their hope is to continue to boost the availability of now to the elderly, particularly outside of bigger cities. So we hope the technology can be operated by non-experts in rural areas. So hopefully those activities can expose the older adults in those areas to more exercise. While some may think they'll feel odd talking to or working alongside a robot, Zhang disagrees. We also find that using a robot or other type of intelligent agent, not human, can help relieve some of the social stigma. Well, now isn't ready to teach in your local community center classes just yet. The technology is rapidly advancing and will likely become just another part of daily life before you know it. Reporting in Rochester, Liam Healy, News 8. All right, we're in now now. When will then be now? Now.